Hey guys, first let me apologize for the bad video quality. I apologize, my game capture card isn't working at the moment. But today I'm going to show all of you how to get um, a lot of easy money in um, Sonic Adventure 2 Battle. Now, the thing is, let me say this, I never said it was time consuming. It's easy, but it's time consuming. So, you go to exit, and then you have to log in as Knuckles. So, if you don't have Knuckles unlocked, just leave the video now, because if you don't have Knuckles, that means that you're not much of a noob, no offense, and you really can't do it if you don't have Knuckles. Pretty much if you need to get, he's in like the second level, you should have him, but if you don't, uh, whatever, if you don't have him, like, you can see him in the chat world. I just beat a hero story. Uh, I had the whole game unlocked, but, like, I lost my memory card, don't judge. So, you have to have these dig claws as well. And you just have to lie around and dig. And then sometimes you'll find stuff. Let's see if we can find anything so I can show you guys, like, can find pumpkins and stuff. I believe. Let's see if we can find anything so I can show you guys what I mean. See, I just found a pumpkin. Now if we bring this to the black market, we can either put this on a chow's head, or we can bring this to the black market and sell it. Let me show you guys. So we bring it to the black market. Welcome to the black market. Uh, oops. We sell items. I can sell this pumpkin for 50 rings. It's a very rare item. Um, which is why I will sell it, because I don't need it, actually. I was going to say I'm not going to sell it. But as you see, you can just sell it to them, and you can just go back and get some more. They're, they're not that hard to get, everyone. And that's a really easy way to get rings. That's the first way to, the first easy way to get the rings. The second easy way is to play City Escape. Let me show you guys real fast how quick and easy it is to get rings. I'm just going to show you guys real fast how easy it is to get gems because I'm just, I mean, coins, I'm sure you guys want to know. Uh, you can pretty much just pick up these and then there's going to be more spawning right here and then right here. And then you can jump off the roof. And then right here. And then you can get the ones at the side. And you can just pick up all the coins. It's really simple, really fast too. Uh, let me, I'll just show you guys a little bit of it, a little bit of the speed you can do on here. You can get those 20 coins, which will give you 20 coins, obviously. But as you see, I already got like 40 coins, and it's been 30 seconds, which is a lot. And you usually don't lose them since the first level. It's, it's not hard at all to do most of the stuff. You can just go like this. You can just get this. And guys, listen, it doesn't matter, the, it doesn't matter about the time because... You're not trying to beat a timer or anything, and if you are, you shouldn't be playing this. You should be trying to get coins, not trying to beat a time limit. So, go back here. I'll show you how many coins you can get. You can just go down here. You can go. Okay, that was a, that was a fail by me. But you can pretty much just go. Boom. Get. And then go. Oh, I missed it. I didn't mean to miss that, but. You guys know what I mean. You can get that, and then I actually want some coins too, so I'm going to do it real fast. So it's been a minute and 30 seconds. Not that long. And um, you just go through here. You can bounce back onto these. Um, you can just go get this. Hit the checkpoint. Go down here. Go off here. Go off here. Go off here. You get some coins up there. Rev roll past him. Run up to this. Jump off this. As you can obviously see, it's very easy to get coins. Oops. It's very easy and quick to get coins. I'll show you how many coins I can get in one round and how long it takes. That, but who cares? More coins over here anyway. Okay, so you jump off this. Oh, I missed the checkpoint. And then you can just go down here with rev roll. You can jump off. You can go boom, boom. Make sure you do that and then use your light dash. That gives you more. 
as you see, I'm already at 200 coins, which is more coins than you're going to get in any other level in three minutes. Besides Wild Canyon. Wild Canyon can get you a lot of money as well, because they have those four pillars. But then you have to find all the emeralds, and it's just annoying. And just real quick, guys, I'm just going to grab this power out, because I forgot to grab it. So just give me like two seconds. Okay, there we go. I love how I just grabbed the power up mid vid. But who cares? Uh you get some twenty twenty or so oh, I I I I didn't do it. Okay, it just made me restart, so I'm not gonna go through it. But you can get almost three hundred coins. It's it's really simple. Really, really easy to get coins. So anyways dudes, I hope you just had enjoyed this video of Sonic Avenger 2 Battle. And if you want more like this, please leave a like, comment down below. And um I'll see you guys later. Peace out everyone and have a great day. Hey guys, what is going on? It is Spartan C9 here, and welcome back to another video. And today we are playing Sonic Adventure 2 Battle again, and I'm gonna show you guys um, how to how to like um, I'm gonna show you guys how to do some glitches, some really cool glitches that I like. Um, I haven't, I didn't make them. I will put their name. Um, and find another YouTube channel, or I'll put information about them every time I show a glitch. But, um, I will show information about them, but, um, I figured out a couple myself, like, just found them out. But if I, if I found them out myself, like, I just found them out when I was bored, and then I'll just put someone's name on it. I'll look up, I'll look up, like, the glitch and see if anyone else has found out. I'll put their name on it, because I don't want hate, because someone else found it as well as me. So I don't feel like doing that, so yeah. But I found a couple of them. Um, most of them were found due to when I was bored and I was surf surfing the web. But here's the first one, so... As you see, I'll show you right now. I have two controllers. I have another controller right here. It's a terrible controller. Um, so I got another controller. And we're going to use my Player One controller. As you can see. Nice, nice limited edition Super Smash Bros. So we're gonna go to action, and we're gonna pick whatever character we want. So we're gonna go Amy. We're gonna need Amy. You need Amy. You can't not be Amy. So I'll just make this guy shadow. Um. So we're gonna go. Hmm. Let's go on Green Forest. Okay. So we got our two characters spawning in. So what this glitch is named is this is the Invincible Amy glitch. Now this will make you invincible in any action race. Um so stop stop moving. Can you stop him from moving? Stop. Stop moving. There you go. Um so what you want to do is you want to kill Amy and hold B right after she dies before she respawns. I will show you holding B. And now you keep holding on to B, you can't let go of it. And if this has worked correctly, if it didn't work correctly in your first try, it doesn't always work on the first try. And now if I if I walk into him, he will get hurt. Um I didn't I didn't click anything, I just walked into him and he got hurt. As you can see, um I'm not clicking anything, I'm just walking into him and he is getting hurt. As you see his three zero rings, he is dead and all I did was walk into him. If he seems that like accidentally oh I didn't even do it say he accidentally runs into me it's like I'm just chilling here and he runs into me he's dead but if I let go of B um now I can't oh it does work if you let go of B oh that's a nice surprise okay so you can let go of B that's pretty cool so you're invincible pretty much and you literally can't win the race can't lose the race if you lost that would be like really disappointed but yeah, so let's get on with the next glitch. That was Invincible Amy. So the second glitch I have to show you, this is called the Dry Glitch. Now, I originally figured out this myself. Um, oops, too far. I didn't mean to go too far. I originally found out this glitch myself, but, um... I found it on the internet many, many, many times. So I'll write the name of a couple guys who else found it as well as me. 
I don't know if they just took it from the other guy and said, hey, I'll go make a video about it, but, you know, um, I figured out this glitch when I was bored, so I'll just show you guys real quick. Ooh, knock story. First thing you want to do, you want to go to any level. Any level that has monsters in it, uh, or not monsters, what am I saying, um, something that you fight in it. So I'm going to Green Forest real fast. Okay, so what this glitch does is you pretty much have to get a, pretty much have to get one of these and grab a drive. You can get any color drive, it doesn't really matter, I'll just grab a couple here, uh, real quick. I'll just grab a couple so I can show you guys. And you don't have to, and then you just, I'll show you guys what to do once I get a couple more drives. Let's just get this guy. Oh, I thought my light attack was going to work on him. Alright, well. <clears throat> so then you just exit your game. Go B, go B, and go to, and go to, um, go to one play, go back to stage select. My bad, I didn't mean to go off it. Go to Chow Garden. You can use whatever character you want. Um, I'm gonna use Rouge, Rouge, just cause I need to train up my Dark Chow a little bit. I love how Rouge is the only girl character in this game. I think so. Well, not the only girl character in Sonic, just the only girl character in this game. So, uh, we have, uh, so. Ooh, I can't be Rouge because I just got a Rouge. I can't really say it. I can't be Rouge right now because I just got the figs with Sonic. I think I got it with Sonic. Yeah, I got it with Sonic. So I got to exit and then come back as Sonic. Or any hero character, really. Guess I'll be trading up my hero channel a little bit better. So, you have your things, you go into your thing, and um, it'll pop out of you. So, you want to get your chow, you want to get him, you want to pick him up and move him where the drives are. So, like right here, seems like a good place. Let's pet him so he stays still. So, what you want to do is you want to take the drive, and you don't want to give it to him, but you want to place it right in front of him. I might take a couple tries, but it's very much worth it. Ooh, sorry, buddy. Oh, no. Don't move. So what we're pretty much doing is we're trying to get him to take it without that happening, without me giving it to him. Give me the pick him. Give me the, give me the pick up. Okay, there we go. And as you see, he has used the drive, but we get the drive back. And we can do that again. And again. Oops. That was a fail. But you can just keep doing that over and over. And just get unlimited stats on your guy and just keep leveling him up really easily. <clears throat> this glitch saves you a lot of time um, because you don't need to go and get more every, every once in a while. So... Yeah, just stomp on our devil jar up there. Cause you gotta stop. You gotta be mean to them on hero with hero characters, or else they're not gonna become the devils. Okay, so we're gonna get on to the next glitch, and I think this one we're gonna make an unlockable because this is the unlockable end sheets guide. So yeah, let's get on to an unlockable. <sighs> Hey guys, so I'm not sure if my chow's ready for this yet, so we're just going to have to try and hope, because this might go horrible, but you know, we can always try. So I'm going to show you guys how to get the ball, um, for the normal chow garden, just a ball for the chow garden, 
So in order to get the ball, you have to go to, and then you just play with it every once in a while. It's pretty good. You go to, um, you go into your uh, Chow, you go into your Chow Stadium. You go to Chow Race, which we're going to be right here. You need to win. You have to go to beginner. You have to pick your chow. So let's see which one can run really fast. Okay, this one can run the fastest. You have to win the first. I believe the first four levels. Let's try it real fast. I'm not sure if my child will be able to do it, everyone. But my child kind of looks like the, the fastest out of all these guys. This one is not really going to fly, not even mine. Uh, child races take forever, guys. I'm going to speed through this, and I'll be right back. guys I'm gonna go get some swimming drives like go get some drives feeding my hero chow and um, actually I don't think I'll be able to do it guys I'm sorry I can't do it but that's pretty much how you do that oh, I promise I'm not lying so yeah see you guys in the next one okay guys so the last one for this episode I have is first of all let me just say um, I'm gonna be making multiple episodes and I'll be playing a lot of games more so please, I'm going to show you all my games on screen now, and please tell me which game you want me to play next, because I don't know which game you want me to play next, and I need to know, because if I don't know, I can't play it. So I got Pac-Man World 2, I got Sonic Adventure 2 Valley, I got For the Odd Parents, I got Jimmy Neutron, I found all my old games by the way, and that's why I have all these. I have Teen Titans, I have... Um, Wii Fit, I have Sonic Adventure DX, I have Super, Super Smash Bros. Brawl, Sonic Unleashed, Zelda, Skylanders, and Super Smash Bros. Brawl, and Sonic Gems Collection. So please let me know. What do you guys want me to play next? Uh, please let me know down below in the comments if you love. But for the last thing I'm going to show you is I am going to show you something really cool. You guys are going to love it. So if you exit this menu, you, if this is not a chair garden thing, uh, so you go back, you go to, to ooh, not two player battle, my bad. This is like a security thing, extra. Uh, you go to, where is it? I don't maybe, no, 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 not emblem results. Uh, go to options, go to options. Go to menu screen theme, change menu screen, and see you have all the people, shadow, you have all the people, I like shadow the most, shadow, rogue, eggman, tails, knuckles, and sonic, and as you probably know, you can buy more at the shop, uh, but here's one that you might not know. So if you turn your analog stick counterclockwise, I don't know what the counterclockwise is to be honest. I 
Let me see if I can get this right. There's like a way that if you turn it that certain way, you'll hear like a ding sound and you'll unlock like a secret thing. Oh, I just heard it. I just heard the noise, I think. I think I heard the noise. Yes, I did. So as you see, we now have like a Maria thing. And if we select it, as you see, it's like Maria's like a secretary or something. I don't know what it is. See? Um, so that's a secret little thing right there. I'm going to change my thing back. Do shadow. But pretty much you can unlock that. And I hope you dudes have enjoyed this episode. And if you did, be sure to show me some love. Hit that like button down below. Maybe we can smash. If we if we get at least a like, I will upload another episode. I hope you guys have enjoyed, and I will see you guys later. Peace out. Goodbye.